Hi everybody from InTown Movie Service. My name is Lung. I'm one of the project managers on site. You can always find more information at InTownMovieService.com. InTownMovieService.com. All right. So, what I'm about to share with you is uh, some of the, the aspects of loading a pod uh, for transport. So that's what this is here. Loading a pod. Uh, it's for one of the clients that called and called and I tried to explain it to her. However. I wasn't able to explain it to her fair enough, so I decided to go ahead and put a video together for her, okay? So the first step is, you obviously, in the pod itself, you have these little clamps. You see these little right here? So you'll have them punched pretty much at every little section. That allows you to be able to partition everything off to keep the load nice and tight as this particular box is being shipped. Okay, my suggestion is, see this blanket right here? You're going to these pads down. I don't know if you can see it, that pad down. Or you can also put like a, a plastic cover around the mattress itself. And that's going to get, that's going to keep from getting a little scuffed. Uh, so notice how you have these boxes right here. This is kind of cool. Right here, and then you place that. So I'm going to show you what's behind this uh, this mattress is the actual wall itself. You can do it either way. You can either start with it or you can end with it. So as you're loading up the pod, you can see here closely with the boxes be along the side. On the top of the mattress is an empty space. So what the boxes do here is it actually secures and tightens that load for you. If you're purchasing boxes, I suggest buy medium boxes. They're easy to handle. At this point, you're looking at your dining room table. The dining room table is uh, actually placed between two slats within that pod. Just so you know, we removed the legs from the table. Okay, right here as the staff continue to load that pod, you're going high and tight uh, as you begin to fill it up. Fill it up, working your way outward. Notice how everything is pushed in tight. As you work from layer to layer. Okay, this is the back side of a mirror, and the, the actual glass side is facing mattresses. You can utilize that technique for other mirrors and pictures as well. This is a king size mattress, and then these boxes right here that actually secure the whole load. Okay, oh, let's try to push that back up. Okay, these are just a little bit of snapshots of the actual load as we continue pulling, putting property in, kind of tightening it up, putting boxes, bags, anything that keeps it nice and tight as we're working our way out of the pot itself. Right here, we're going to imagine that we have completed the task of loading the pod. Now that everything is loaded, what we're doing is we're creating a petition so, to actually close off right from there. front to rear. You just put it up like you're using putting a, a petition or a wall. So all the boxes are going to go back here. It's going to come all the way up until you get to the mattress. Go ahead and stand that mattress straight up, just side by side, like that. Okay, just push it against that wall. So what you're creating is a petition at that point. Then you're going to get this ratchet strap tied to here, and then you're going to run it all. You got two usually inside the unit itself, and then you're going to attach it to this one here, and that is secure. That would create that partition, and you're going from the t from the bottom as well as the top, creating yeah, creating a creating a uh, a secured uh, load. So uh, hopefully this gives you a better idea on how to load uh, a pod tight for transport. You can always find us online at intownmovingservice.com, intownmovingservice.com. Don't forget to like us. Don't forget to share.